Vindy go. It's his decision and the doctor's decision, but you'd imagine that it's too much of a risk for Casillas to continue. But Following the conclusion of this one, and what a place to end it. It will be Barcelona at A bar. Where, Phil? The mighty A bar. Thank you. Who are sticking around for yet another <laughs> La Liga season. The little team that could. The price of those condominiums at that stadium goes up and up and up. A risky pass by Mandi, but he makes it work. Captoum back to the French born Algerian and back to the Cameroonian. Shades of Eto continuing to push forward. But now they'll pull it back. Guardado. And it looks like there's a player down. A couple of hours' time taking on the champions Barcelona here on BN Sports. Look at this again. Willie Cavallo. Are you kidding me, Ford? Here comes Hesse motoring in. And there's Baran with the speed bump. Well, we've talked so much about Real Madrid. What about Real Betis? Does Joaquin stick around for another season? Should Kike? Closing out with two wins, including one of the Bernabeu. Yeah. Well, it was a hugely disappointing season. It went terribly, terribly off the rails for Betis. And certainly their quality under this coach has been... Yeah, take us one last night. Oh, across. You're not doing that just because of Detroit, are you? He's <laughs> <laughs> also picking up speed. Modric forcing him in return. By the way, one of Modric's compatriots may be on the move. Although, maybe some of that a little too premature, at least if you listen to Freddie Bobic. But Eintracht Frankfurt triggering the purchase clause for Luka Jovic from Benfica. What was it about? I think seven million dollars. Yeah. Bobic saying there have been discussions with Real Madrid, but to say there is a deal is premature, and they are considering finding a way to keep him with Eintracht next season. Now the money that could be thrown in that direction might be too much to turn down, but Messi and Bruno. PK Setien giving Rodriguez perhaps one chance to roam on his old ground. You could hear the screams that he'll be going anywhere. No one on the back post. Fearful under pressure, but handles it. And you see there the ability ball. to handle the pressure by Setien's team. Fearful ah. could not find Moron. Very industrious, but nice pass of the ball and certainly shrewd with his decision making is what I've liked about him yeah. is he the future to take the place of Casemiro Cross and Modric well he'll get the stage under Zidane by the looks of it mentioned the victory last year Real Betis in this tie one nothing thanks to Sanabria's 90th minute tally thing I didn't mention is it was that game that ended Real Madrid's 73 match scoring streak a Spanish record to give you an idea of the problems they have had since though Ray because that was back in September of last year so pretty much two seasons away ended 73 matches in a row with a goal they've been shut out 13 times in the last year and could be 14 here Maron soars and scores over the diving Kaylor Navas and Betis in front. Well, come on. He just opened Real Madrid's defense up like a fresh fish. Fourth assist of the season for the Mexican. Sixth goal for the man from Marbella in his first season with the Betis first team. Bit of a slow starter for Moron, but you can see the potential. And now at 25, maybe, just maybe, he'll be ready to burst out next year. It's high at 50 points. 
Sociedad with the edge over Betis, who have the edge yeah. over Alaves. Here's Marcelo. Tackled by Mandy there early on. Lovely little ball out again. And Real Madrid would be stuck at 68 points. Oh. Ray, there was a stretch there. That season, poor Pellegrini. Ball driven in Asensio, glancing header cleared by Francis. No. Even Played. better by Klopp and Liverpool, and still not good enough to beat okay. Pep. William Cavallo got options. The big Portuguese midfielder leading the break, four on five. Wide for Firpo. Ball back. Oh! Slapped away. In some ways, you figure maybe less changes than many would think. Oh, I don't know, Phil. Remember Zinedine Zidane, this is still pretty much what he had to win three straight European crowns. Well, this result stands, and the result goes Barcelona. Swear, they're going to be 23 points behind Barcelona. That's beyond embarrassing. I mean, there's an argument out there that states that the Champions League papered over a lot of the cracks, and this team needed to be refreshed and replenished at least. But as in Vinicius and Asensio, where do they all find their place in Real Madrid? Madrid Madridistas are always asking about it. They've got to do something with this defense, though. So. Here's Guardado attacking the space left vacant by Marcelo. Modric, the again, last man back. Again, and not the last man back. He makes himself the first man back. And again, attitude of Luca, impeccable. Talked about that 2002 era as Los Elso tees it up, what? dipping it wide across oh. from Firpo. Well, the next season, Ray, Florentino Perez just one transfer. Opportunities missed before, but he is sharp as vinegar with his strike. And again, wonderful goal set up by the Mexican. Will it be good enough? 75th minute underway. Oh, again, magic from William Cavallo. has got to be up there for man of the match as well. Scooping it through, Hesse tries to win it back. Hesse spending a decade with Real Madrid. Bursting out of the youth team. 60-plus matches for the first team before making the jump to PSG. Chance now, top of the 18. They are wide. They're pulled back for nice the Celso. Lead. Tease it up for the Dominican. Back for Hesse, who scores in his return. Again, but the whistles really start to circulate now, and there's more than 15 minutes to be added. Let's see what sort of response they can pull out of this fire, but they're going to hear it. Haven't seen the white hankies. I think they already realize that when Zidane stepped in, they were already gearing up for next year. Not good enough. Well, his performances, in my opinion, haven't lived up to that standing. And yet, he has been the man who produces the big, big moments as much as Cristiano Ronaldo did in many, many ways. So. Well, he was supposed I don't to think be the there's next any accident Ronaldo. that this man that is sitting on the bench isn't even being thrown into the fray to save Real Madrid's blushes by Zidane because I think he's sparing them the abuse that he probably would receive. And it's harsh words. And hey, it may be misguided in my eyes, but you just look at the body of work. He has been. A strange sort of remembrance for Real Madrid. And the big question is, who's going to take him? Where does Gareth Bale land? They need the money to spend on the big, big players. Could a deal be done with Manchester United for Paul Pogba? Manchester United have said they don't want Gareth Bale. How much does that say? Man United that needs players of high quality, right, left and centre. They're saying, no thanks. Latest reports could mean a return to Spurs, but you never know. Of course, a certain.